Hi, Kidsman fam. It's Miss Rhonda coming to you today live and in living color from my house. Who would have guessed it? But listen, guys, today I'm so excited because today we are going to learn about being part of a team and what that means to be part of a team. Now, like many of you, most of the time when I think of a team, I think of my favorite team, which of course is the Florida Gators. Or sometimes we may think about our favorite football team or even maybe our favorite basketball team. But today I want you to think about a team that's not a sport, a team that each and every one of you are a part of every single Wednesday and Sunday. And guess what? That's our kids men team. And I bet you guys didn't know that we have kids men teammates in Atlanta. Yes, we do. We have a crossover church in Atlanta and they have a kids men team just like ours. So today's lesson is so special because today our kids men team and the Atlanta kids men team are going to come together and teach you guys an awesome lesson about being a part of God's team. So stay tuned. We're going to worship together and then we're going to get into our lesson. And of course, we're going to thank God for allowing us to be part of his amazing team. I'll catch you guys at the end of the lesson. Bye. Hey, kids, it's Darnell here and I've got DJ. DJ's in here. DJ, what's one of your favorite parts of Kids Church? Singing and dancing. Singing and dancing. So I say we do a little bit of that right now. How about you? Ready to sing and dance? Yep. Let's do it.
Today's story comes from a book in the Bible called Acts. Can you say Acts? Acts. In Acts, there was a team of people who loved God and wanted to learn more about him. So they would get together every day, just like we do here at church. They shared everything that they had with each other. They even prayed together. Can you guys pray? Good job, guys. So if someone was hurt or someone was sick, you could lay your hands on that person and you can help pray for them to feel better. Does anyone here have an owie that we can pray for? Yeah. You guys have owies? Okay. Can you help me pray for their cuts? Let's pray real quick, okay? We're gonna close our eyes and we're gonna posture our hearts Wait. in prayer. Say, Jesus, Jesus. help my owie, Open my owie to feel better. Fire. Amen. Great job, friends. And that's it. And they even ate all their meals together. And God was using his special team of people to do great things. God's team of people helped out whenever they needed to. So if somebody needed food to eat, a place to live, or clothes, God's people would help them right away. Let me see you show your biggest smile. Jeez, can you show them a happy face? Go show them a happy face. Look at those smiles. You guys look great. And I'm sure you guys at home do too. Yeah, just like that. You look so happy. That's what God's team looked like when they were all together. They praise God by singing songs and telling stories, much like we do when we're together at church. God added more and more people to his team. Let's hear it for God's team. Good job. God wants you and me to play on his team too. You love God and you want to be a part of his team. Just repeat after me. I play. I play. For God's team. For God's team. Woo! Yeah! Great job, friends. Thank you for seeing us today. Bye-bye. What an amazing story about being part of God's team through the early church. How awesome is it that they shared absolutely everything that they had with each other? I think that there are ways that we can find in our day during this week to figure out how we can share the love of God and to share our things with our family and friends around us. And I hope you agree. So that's my challenge for you guys today. Find a way to share and to be part of God's team in that way, just like the early church. So let's go to prayer and let's just thank God for him allowing us to be part of his amazing team. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much. We thank you, God, that you made sacrifices for us, just for each and every one of us to be a part of God's team. And God, we promise you that we're going to make every effort this week to at least share something with someone that we know or someone that we love so that just like the early church, you can be pleased with us and know that we are doing our part and playing our part on your team. We love you, Jesus, and we thank you. In your name we pray. Amen. So guys, until next week, I expect you guys to be praying and sharing having fun with your family and friends, and of course, making sure you're working on your memory verse and your lesson for the week. So until next time, remember, we're all part of God's team. Bye, guys. <laughs>